You gotta get more sauce. Oh my god. My tongue, babe. <laughs> my tongue is on fire. You're not that spicy. Yes, it is. <laughs> What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Calvin. <laughs> Yo, I am hangry than a mother okay, and I'm ready to eat this food. We have not eaten all day. Well, we ate this morning, but... It's been a minute. Yeah, we're hungry. Yeah. If this is your first time to our channel, make sure you go ahead and like and subscribe. Show our channel some love. And turn those post notifications on. That way we post, you the first, first to know. No. Yes, sir. We're so hungry. Bro. And we got a mukbang food yeah. right here. I'm so excited because we've been wanting to do this for a minute. Yeah, we love to eat. If there is one place you guys will find Calvin and I, it is someplace out eating. Like that is Man. our love language, <laughs> like getting dressed up and going out to eat somewhere, trying a new restaurant, especially brunch. That is like- Oh yeah, brunch is where it's at for real. Yeah, both of us love to do it. And I am so glad that I have a man that enjoys doing it with me because yeah. it's the key to my heart, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Food is definitely the key to this woman's heart. If she's feeling hungry, you better get her some food before she gets angry. <laughs> you too. <laughs> yeah, that's facts. Mm. Hey, and just like before we start this, I want to let y'all know, this chair I'm sitting on is squeaky as hell. <laughs> and then also, Louis is over there. He wants to play with his ball, but we're not going to let him play. So if y'all hear a dog crying or y'all hear a squeaky chair, <laughs> y'all know what's up. Shout out to Marshalls for the cheap chair. <laughs> for the $50 because... <laughs> chair. <laughs> That's why it's squeaky. But anyways, so we have a lot of wings on our lineup today. Yeah, we... we got a lot. We chose a lot of flavors, and if you stick around to the end of this video, if you're a real one and you watch all the way through, we, Calvin and I got the hottest wing at Wingstop. We got the- What is it called? Atomic bomb. The atomic bomb, which is not that big of a deal for me. Like, I'm still low-key, like, I'm, I'm shook a little bit. I'm kind of scared to eat it, but- she don't really eat spicy, like, she likes spicy stuff, I but do. not like that. I love, like, I love hot Cheetos, but you guys, I'm a weenie. I can't handle it. Like, <laughs> I will still eat it, and I will be drinking a whole water bottle with, like, per chip. I love spices, but I can't handle the heat. <laughs> she gonna be shit and fire. <laughs> no, TMI. <laughs> we are not about to do me like that. So, you guys, we got five different flavors, babe. Mm -hmm. And some french fries. And we got some buns as well. Hey, let us know your, your heat tolerance, like, on a scale of one to 10, are you guys messing with the spicy food? Are you like, you like spicy food or you don't? Drop a comment and let us know. Yeah, I typically go for like the um, garlic, a lemon pepper or garlic parmesan. Although I will say like, I am not a fan of Wingstop's lemon pepper. I know. I'm getting a lot of hate <laughs> from a lot of people yeah, because Wingstop lemon pepper. That's like if you hear Rick Ross talk <gasps> about Wingstop, he's music. always like, "I'm gonna give me some lemon pepper wings." Like everybody loves women, lemon pepper from Wingstop. That's like the main one. I'm not a fan of it. I don't know what it is, but it's I'm hard. talking about. I'm gonna get a lot of hate because I don't like bone wings i uh, i pretty much just eat the tenders like yeah. i just eat chicken tenders there's a lot of people out there like i that. like i am that person that will not eat all of me on the yeah bone. that bugs me she'll take like three bites of the bone <laughs> in wings and it'd be like i'm done calvin gets so <laughs> mad at me but can we start eating because yes i am hangry oh my gosh this smells so good this is the lemon garlic yeah we got some french Ooh. fries Oh, what this else? is me and Jess both love this one. This is the Louisiana rub. Mm. It's like a dry rub. That one's really good. Dink. Can you see? Ooh, Do you guys see that? Buttery bun. Mm. That's what your buns look like. <laughs> <laughs> These are the Parmesan wings. The Atomic. Stay tuned to the those end of the video. Those just look hot. Yeah, they look hot as hell. We're going to be eating those, you guys. This one's got a lot of seasoning. Oh, yeah. See all that? Dang. That's one thing I will say about Wingstop is they they know how to flavor their food. Yeah, sometimes that wing, epic wing and things they <laughs> they don't be putting that seasoning on there, and I have to order it on the side. But let's go ahead. Cheers. Mmm. Yeah. Oh my god. <gasps> I think we have a new favorite. That is so good. I want to try it with some cheese. We also got cheese sauce. In ranch. I don't know if you guys can see it in ranch. Mmm. 
You know, I have no idea how good this is right now. Oh my gosh, that hits. I am surprised. It might be because I'm really hungry, but I give this a 10 out of 10 right now. Yo, we got the fries. Eat it with the cheese. Mm-hmm. Mmm. You gotta smack me, babe. <laughs> we did have a few things that we wanted to talk to y'all about, man. First things first is, when are we getting married? Mm -hmm. When are we getting married, babe? Do you want to start it off? Or I'll let you. Yeah, go ahead. So, I mean, Calvin and I have like talked about this because so many people have been asking us like, when's the date? When are you guys getting married? Have you guys started planning? So pretty much we just want to enjoy being engaged and we don't want to have to stress too much about wedding planning and just enjoy the honeymoon so to say, of being engaged. Yeah. So we're giving ourselves about a year to just enjoy being engaged and not have to worry about stressing or not have to worry about planning and just getting everything ready for a wedding. Um, so we're giving ourselves a year and then we'll start planning. When we got engaged, there was just so much going on and so much that happened. And so life is just pretty crazy that right now we just kind of want to like mellow out and chill, not have to stress about a wedding right now and just enjoy being fiance yeah like we just moved in together we got this beautiful new apartment mm -hmm. we really just stepped into a new chapter of our life so like really looking forward to getting married and setting a date mm -hmm. but we're more so focused on enjoying this present moment because like i was telling her earlier i'm not going to always be able to call you my fiance mm -hmm. like i'm only going to be able to call her my fiance for a certain period of time so yeah. like we're not about rushing into like the next step of our life to impress anyone or to check a box and said that we did something like mm -hmm. we really just want to enjoy our lives and um and that's one thing that i feel like sorry to cut you off i feel like we're both on the same page is that we go at it at our own pace and we we're not worried about the pressure of what anybody else thinks it's how we feel and what we feel is right for us. Another thing too is that we don't even know what kind of wedding exactly we want to have. We don't know if we want to have destinational, we don't know if we want to have it here, something more intimate, mm -hmm. um, or if we want to have a more, a bigger wedding. But yeah, so we also just want to give ourselves the time to decide what we want to do. And sometimes honestly, we're just like, let's elope, let's go to the courthouse and yeah. then like have a whole vacation, a month vacation. So I don't know, we're still thinking about that and just really giving ourselves the time to decide what we really want. All right. Cheers. Cheers to you guys. Cheers to the CJ oh. fan. <laughs> Love you guys, man. Oh, good. Definitely like the other one better, but this one was. The other one was just so flavorful that yeah. this one it's kind of bland. <laughs> yeah, but it's good. Yeah, it's still I good. like it. I've been itching to get blasted. Like, mm -hmm. I've been wanting to get more tattoos so bad, you guys. Like, right now, what I'm focused on is I want to finish both of my arms, like, get full sleeves on both sides. I have a my chest, I have a chest piece, but I got it so long ago when I was young. You got that, like, in high school. Yeah, I got it, like, over 10 years ago. So, I've grown a lot, like my body has grown since I've had the tattoos. So like, it doesn't, it's not symmetrical. I've like outgrown, mm -hmm. you know, my skin has stretched. So. I think your style has changed a little bit. Yeah. Too. So I'm gonna go back to my artist. I still go to the same artist and I'm gonna have her like, do my, redo my chest piece, make mm -hmm. sure everything looks very aesthetic and symmetrical and, and lines up with my physique and my body. And Calvin's artist is really good. She has some yeah, dope, dope artwork. She's actually done Kehlani's tattoo, huh? Mm -hmm. And she travels too, you guys. So I could put her her uh, Instagram down in the description. Mm -hmm. If you're interested in seeing her work, you want to check her out, she travels. So go ahead and tap in with her. Yeah, so I'm trying to finish my sleeves, finish both arms, redo my chest piece. And then I also want to hit my legs. I want to get my legs fully sleeved up and get them blasted. I have so many great ideas for it too. like. It's just a matter of getting it done. Mm -hmm. So stay tuned for that. If y'all want, I could do a little vlog on that too. We could vlog the, the experience of getting blasted. Baby, I ain't gonna front. I started on the Louisiana rub. You ate it without me? I don't really fuck with the Parmesan like that. It's all right. Wow. You guys, I'll probably, give, I'll probably give the Parmesan like, maybe like a seven out of 10. I love it. 
That's, that's something I always get, but today was layer. kind of a seven out of 10. Because we started with the lemon garlic and that one was so good. This girl used the buns as like a sandwich and put the Louisiana rub wings inside of it with some honey mustard sauce, I think. And it was so good. So Yo, if you guys haven't tried it. She was going it. in, you guys. She made a whole ass sandwich out of the wings and everything. Like It was good. Ordered like $50 worth of food to make this sandwich. But it looked good. It looked fire, whatever she had. I should have just it today. <laughs> I don't know if I want this one right now. You guys, you guys hear her? <laughs> she said the Louisiana rub, Louisiana dry rub. It's a little spicy. It's spicy. We got these atomic b coming up, so. <laughs> I don't know if we explained what we're doing earlier, but with the atomic b we are both gonna eat one at the same time, mm -hmm. and whoever drinks water first loses. I'm so nervous. And whoever loses, y'all get to say like a dare that one of us has to do. Whoever loses wow. has to do that dare. Hey, you guys, one thing that I'm excited about coming up. Oh, we about to try these corns, by the way. What is Cajun these called? Cajun corn? Yeah, Cajun corn. They're really like? good. I like them. Fire. Mm -hmm. It's like a spicy corn. It's yeah, fire. It's a little spicy. Oh my gosh. I'm... <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> I am nervous for those wings because that just like winded me and they normally don't. They must have really put the seasoning on it. I feel like I need to take some Pepsi this mobile. <laughs> <laughs> I told y'all she's gonna be shitting fire. Stop! <laughs> my sister Brandy, she is pregnant. She's about to have my little nephew here soon. Mm -hmm. uh, coming up at the end of June. Little baby Cam. Yeah, little Cam is on the way. Shout out to you, Brandy. Mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna be having her baby shower. You guys, we'll 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 try to vlog it. We'll probably end up vlogging that video. Hopefully, mm -hmm. um, it's gonna be a hectic day, but we're gonna try to vlog it for you guys. Uh, drop a comment down below. Just tell my sister congratulations on the new baby. Little Cam is on the way. So excited to yeah. meet him. We're excited. We're able to um, to host her baby shower too, where mm -hmm. we live. So uh, it's an honor to be able to host her baby shower. To be able to help my sister because my sister has had such a positive influence on my life and has like really helped me in a lot of ways. So I'm She's like- super helpful. Yeah, mm -hmm. like both of us. So we're really grateful to be able to host her baby shower, something like so significant at our house. Yes, like indeed. it means a lot to us. Look, <laughs> hey, you guys, Jessica is literally psyching herself out about these hot wings. She is so scared to eat these wings I'm right not now. ready. We really want to start doing more like vlogs and mukbangs and like challenges and challenges on our on our channel if that's something y'all interested in seeing drop a comment and let us know like if y'all like watching mukbangs on youtube mm -hmm. if y'all want to see us do mukbangs y'all want to see us do vlogs and challenges let us know man because that's something we're very interested in doing for you guys i know that we have on some of our last mukbangs that we've done a lot of people have told us that they enjoy watching them and they want to see more so drop a comment, let us know down below what you would like to see and mm -hmm. maybe we'll film that next. Yeah, what kind of food y'all wanna see us eat? We have been wanting to try like um, African food. Uh -huh. What are them, the ones you were watching? The, what's it called, like bonbons? Nan nan? Uh, <laughs> what's it called? Nan is um, Indian food, but. Um, we wanna try Indian food too. They eat the fufu. opium. Fufu, yeah, mm -hmm. I wanna try fufu. That, it sounds good. Yeah, but that we have to go to LA. So that will yeah, be like a in trip in itself. If y'all have some ideas for different foods for us to try, let us know, man. It just looks spicy. It looks hot. Look at that. <laughs> oh my God. I don't know if I can see it. You, you guys, my <laughs> nose is already running like, and I haven't even oh. had anything like super hot. Yo. Just is about to die, you guys. Calvin will put too much pepper in his, like, any food that he makes, and I can't handle <laughs> it. I will not be able to eat it. This oh is... my gosh, you can literally see the chili flakes on there. <laughs> this I... is the atomic bomb from my stomach Wingstop. Hurts first, Just yeah. as a reminder, you guys, so we're seeing who taps out first after eating this atomic bomb. Whoever taps out first, you guys get to drop a comment and drop a dare for either myself or just to do, <laughs> we'll choose the dare and we'll post it in our next video. You okay. ready, babe? Okay. Um. Wait. Should I really? Should I take some of the? <laughs> Look, she is shook, you guys. She, yeah, go ahead. Take your should Pepto Bismol okay. real quick. She gonna be <laughs> shit fire, no, you guys. No, not that. I just don't want to be in pain. Mm -hmm. I get really bad acid reflux and heartburn. Like really bad heartburn. All right. Cheers. I'm so nervous. Mmm, that's a good flavor. Kind of tastes like a pickle. It's so hot. Oh my God. <laughs>
I don't know if I can swallow it. Mm. Like oh my it. gosh. This is not fair. Mm. If you're over there enjoying it, <laughs> you gotta get more sauce. Oh my god. My tongue, babe. <laughs> my tongue is on all fire. It's not that spicy. Yes, it is. <laughs> babe, I'm so serious. Stop. <laughs> I see that fam, go ahead, and start dropping Yo. those comments. Don't this do that. fair though, you're literally enjoying it and you're eating mine. I am trying to act tough because this is hot. I can't even see the camera right now. <laughs> my vision is like blurry. Okay, I can't. You are over dramatic. Oh my gosh, I need, I need tissue. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Woo, that shit was hot. I like it. Oh why, my gosh. Why is it so spicy? <laughs> <laughs> why is why it so spicy? spicy? <laughs> Look how hot it is. Like, I'm literally sweating from eating that. <gasps> Babe. My head is sweating. Your head is dripping. <clears throat> oh. It's that hot, you guys. I don't recommend. I'm gonna give that a zero out of 10. I couldn't even taste any <laughs> flavor. It was literally just- Just fire. Hot. All right, you guys, we're staying true to our word and we are doing a- Post notification shout out, Ooh. let's go. So today's post notification shout out goes to who, babe? My man, Eric Dudley. Eric has been showing a lot of love on our channel recently. Yep. So shout out to you. Keep tapping in, what is it, Eric? We really appreciate your support. We love it, man. Mm -hmm. Thank, Thank you, for you for always commenting something positive yeah. and uplifting. If you guys want a shout out in our next video, drop a comment and let us know. Make sure to turn your post notifications on. That way and, we can give you a shout out. And make sure you are subscribed yes. and that you are liking our videos. And next time we will make sure to give you a shout out. Jessica lost the bet, you guys. So make sure to go ahead and drop a comment. Let her know what her dare is. Oh my gosh. I really hope you guys enjoyed the vlog, man, or the, the mukbang. We want to do more mukbangs for you guys. So please let us know if you guys like these type of videos, yes. okay? Let us know. And please don't go too hard on me because <laughs> I'm in pain. My stomach hurts. Hope you guys enjoyed our video today, man. Mm -hmm. Me and my beautiful fiance are going to enjoy the rest of our day. We love you guys and thank you for tapping in with us. And we'll catch you guys in our next video. Peace. Bye, guys. <laughs>